Yo guys, uh, Alex for NS Audio. I have a tip for you regarding uh, the span analyzer. Uh, it has the possibility to not only do the mono but also the mid side, which is very useful when uh, mixing and finalizing your tracks. So what I usually do is I grab a great track, in this case uh, the player. And then I uh, grab my own track, which I'm mixing right now. And as you can see in here, I'm almost there. Unfortunately, uh, right now you only see the mono signal. And it's very important to see both. Um, so in this instance I have both on. And now you have a much better view of what your sound is doing. It's very important to have uh, a good balance between your mono and stereo mix. Now the, reason, the, the way you can do this is by going to mid-side, stereo, then go to this, select your color, and then go back to mid. And then you have both, and that way it's very easy to see if you're on any peaks or uh, wongs and just change them so the best way to do is, is put an EQ on your master before your limiter and change whatever needs to be changing so in this instance I EQ'd a little in the highs uh, best of luck and let me know if you need any more help regarding this